Hi guys, Lisa Franco here. Um, I'm out here in Golden Gate Estates in one of the properties that we're actually doing a flip. Uh, we've bought this property maybe about a month, a month and a half ago. Um, it's been a little hard because there's labor shortage and material shortage. But I wanna show you guys uh, this property that we just purchased. Um, I will be posting the before pictures. I just don't have them on me. Um, beautiful property on two and three quarter acres with a pool, a detached garage. Um, beautiful three, two. We're trying to do that uh, farmhouse country look. Um, so take a look, come with me, let, let me show you. So it's nicely set back. So it's an older home, I believe it's the 90s, but it's a nice, with a nice detached two car garage. Now, what I would do, it's just uh, we don't really have a lot of time right now because of the uh, the permits are taking a little longer, but I would do right there in that two car garage, I personally would do a guest house. That would be awesome. So come with me, let me show you. We paint it, it's a new roof. We're gonna be putting some landscaping out here. Special paint it, the floor paint out here. Put some landscaping as well. It's got a beautiful, beautiful pool. I love all this space to sit out here, do some barbecue during the summer. The floor will be redone. Like this has to be, it's gonna be pressure clean, painted. Um, the lot is 100% upland, beautiful, beautiful lot. Um, as you can see, do a bonfire in the back. Um, the pool's been cleaned already. Um, it was just refurbished the piles were just put in brand new so it's coming along it's coming along it's a beautiful beautiful home uh country setting out here two and a half acres on a beautiful lot i'll show you what that looks like it's just so beautiful and out here you can actually have um a guest house if you wanted to you can build a detached this one already has a detached garage i personally think that would be nice to convert to a um actually um a guest house and i would just do a detached garage somewhere else you have plenty of room out here to do it so that's what i would think i would do uh, this where they had the bonfire before so this is the property that we picked up uh, we are renovating it and fixing it up and just going to be putting it right back on the market so if you're looking for an investment or you want to learn how to do investments um, if you're a realtor and want to learn the ropes like i told you guys uh, call me up let me know uh, what you've got if you got a scenario that you want to run by me, I'll be more than happy to um, give you some pointers and ideas. But um, normally that you want to make sure that, you know, the home has good bones, good location. Uh, this particular one has over two acres, two and three quarter acres with a detached garage. So location is key um, when it comes to these investments. So I'll be posting videos um, and giving you an update we got in here about a month and a half ago. I, I do have some before pictures, but I had not done a video as to the update on this property. It will be coming to the market probably within 30 days. That's kind of the goal. Um, so if you are looking for a property, three, two with a family room and a pool, a detached garage that could be converted to a guest house in the future, uh, 2.73 acres, then call me up. I'll have this in the market within 30 days. Um, in addition, if you are a realtor looking to invest and you need some pointers, let me know. I'll be more than happy to help you out. And uh, if you're an investor looking for something to either invest for flip or invest for rental, let me know. I'll help you calculate your return on investment to see if it makes sense. Uh, right now, we had the Fed that just came out on 
last week on Thursday, I think, or Friday. And they talked about the fact that they're going to be increasing the interest rates next year three times. So it looks like they're going to go a quarter three times. So probably the first interest rate hike will be within the first quarter of next year. And um, we'll see what happens. But right now, we still have very low inventory. Um, inflation is still high, and that's one of the things that they, they're they concerned about. And they were not concerned about it at the beginning, but now they realize that it is a concern. So they are stopping some of the, or reducing some of the purchases of the uh, bonds, meaning less money is going to be pushed down to the market. And what that happens is the less money that is out there to be spent, you know, things start retracting. So, and with the interest rate hikes next year, uh, it's only a quarter of a percent, but little by little, you know, they're gonna be increasing a little bit more, still very low. I mean, I remember when I bought my first property in 1994, I purchased, uh, we had just gotten married and uh, it was 8%, 8 uh, percent interest rate. So that was uh, a big change. So again, don't be afraid if you need to buy, go do it. But if it's for investment, um, you want to make sure that it makes sense. So call me up, Lisette Franco, The Franco Group, EXP Realty, uh, and make it a beautiful day.